I think what we have come to realize is uh, while the internet is and remains uh, a huge uh, space of endless opportunity, uh, it is also uh, becoming uh, a space, a living space for new threats and vulnerabilities. Uh, and I think that requires uh, rethinking uh, in some aspects uh, of, of the approach. Uh, the internet shall not be, as some people may still think, uh, 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 a lawless uh, area where no rules apply. But I think we should find a way that uh, to enforce uh, uh, those rules that are um, valid in the in the analog space, also in the digital world. So, no hate speeds, no uh, uh, aggressiveness, uh, uh, no threatening of people, and uh, so that is one aspect. Uh, and the other aspect, from my perspective, is uh, as uh, as far as uh, social media have become real media, because they are the main source of information for many people, especially younger people, they also need to uh, be uh, following the rules that, uh, that are enacted for traditional media outlets. Uh, uh, and I think a lot can be achieved by transferring uh, these, these rules onto the digital space in what shape or form is something to be discussed in more detail, but I think also to fight uh, misinformation and fake news in the media, some kind of regulation as we have it in the media world is, uh, is uh, uh, absolutely necessary. I think the, the whole uh, approach of multi-stakeholder uh, initiatives has been very useful and I think it needs to be uh, further uh, enforced and revitalized. I think we will host uh, the Internet Governance Forum in Berlin later in the year. I think there is a role for the state uh, in this uh, and there is a role for this on an international level because one of the dangers I see uh, with uh, too much of national regulation is that with the internet will not no longer be a unified global space but will be divided into an American and a Chinese and a Russian internet and that leaves the question where where is the EU in all of that. Uh, so uh, regulation also from an EU perspective makes a lot of sense and as we've seen with the General Data Protection Directive uh, as long as the EU is such an important market with uh, a high number of affluent consumers uh, rules and standards that are set here will have uh, a, a global impact uh, and, uh, and we should also have a, a strong look at the, the constructive role that huge international internet companies uh, can play, uh, especially when it comes to um, protecting data also from interference from certain state agencies, in particular in certain countries. So uh, there, is a, there is a role for everyone in this, but it needs to be uh, based on a multi-stakeholder approach and on, a, on, a, on an open uh, dialogue and discourse uh, that we will need to have in the years to come. Thank you.